Hello, I'm FoxyK14 and welcome to the moment you have all been waiting for. Open Beta is finally here for Monster Galaxy. Now, I'm going to take you through the fe some of the features and whatnot <clears throat> and just tell you a little bit about my team as well. First, let's do that first actually. So, <clears throat> my team is Frostfang, Servalin, Keysbok, Loco, and K9. I don't know why I went one extra. Anyway, <clears throat> there's all of my Moga in one glorious bunch. Here's the gallery. <clears throat> so, yes, there are some returning Mogas here. I can only assume that down the line, these new Mogas that were announced <clears throat> and that I've done videos on will be introduced. But here, here's Super Rare. Here's Rare. Uncommon. <clears throat> Common. Beginner. And <clears throat> if at any point you want to pause the video, take a look over something, then be my guest. Go right ahead. Anyway, now the bond section. Here you need uh, specific mogas to create certain bonds. Uh, so, you know, we've got loads of different bonds that you can make. Here's my active one with Dino, Lambo, and Beefy. Simply because I have no other moga. And as you can see as well, uh, bond add-on, cure effect 2.2, bond add-on, hoist defense 3%, hoist attack 2.9%. So, different bonds do different things. Now, backpack. <clears throat> backpack is where your equipment is stored, your items are stored, your moga chips are stored. And equipment goes on your MOGA. <coughs> Self-explanatory. You know, so you have like stone, a ring, a cloak, and a scroll. You give them items to your MOGA, they become more powerful in terms of defense and attack, depending on what the item is. Well, equipment is, I should say. Items. <clears throat> you um, can also use these items for equipment and MOGA. The stone here, Astral Nucleus, you use to um, upgrade your MOGA. Like, their stars, I should say. Crystals in the top right here. I have um, a lot of. They they are used for um, to help um, level up your MOGA and to help upgrade equipment. MOGA chips. <clears throat> Collect enough MOGA chips and you will be able to have yourself a full moga for example this burger here i have 10 of 200 moga chips if i get 190 more i will then have enough chips for a burger <laughs> i didn't mean to make a joke like that anyway moving forward <clears throat> um this is your battle screen. <clears throat> um, here you get mail. This will tell you your uh, Genesis Moga add-on privileges. Uh, 
I didn't mean to click that. Uh, here you have quests. You have daily quests, which is like refresh the arena, win material dungeon, stuff like that. And then you've got achievement quests, which is like this top one for battle is uh, finishing off a boss battle. And a boss comes every 10 levels. So <clears throat> that's that. You know, battle is just w about winning battles. <clears throat> uh, culture, as you can see here, you've got to uh, make 60 gachas. <clears throat> own 15, 15 star equipments. So the ring, the cloak and all that. <clears throat> and complete quick handling four times. Quick handling is on your battle menu. It is down here <clears throat> below the chest. chest. I had I just received a notification interrupt and made that the cut out. <clears throat> the chest can be left for up to 12 hours of which then you can claim a full chest of stuff, you know, like crystal. I'll do it now. <clears throat> you can gain crystals, player XP, Moga XP, and these gift things. I'll get it, of which is part of an event. And collect, you know, it's just about collecting crystals. It says here, own five, level 100 Moga. You know, it's just about collecting things, basically. <clears throat> and obviously, as you might have been able to see here, um, where is it? Oh, it's in collect, sorry. Um, here, in the plantation, harvest one time. So obviously that's part of the home section of which you need to unlock. And it says here, clear 540 to unlock homeland. Like I said, so now let's check out the arena. This is the arena. You, you've got three people up for challenge. Here's your challenge record. So you see each um, successful attack and defense and successful or failed attack or defense. Got a leaderboard here. <clears throat> and your prizes depending on where you finish up. The arena is just battling other pe like human players. <clears throat> Here you have dungeons. You have a daily dungeon, which is made up of a crystal dungeon, an EXP dungeon, um, which is Moga EXP, <clears throat> and you have a material dungeon, which I cannot unlock, which I have not unlocked yet, but very soon. You have Endless Trial, which is liter quite literally <clears throat> an endless num. Well, it's not truly endless, and I'll explain this when I get to it. But <clears throat> um, it's battle after battle after battle with um, increasingly difficult battles and mogas to base off of against. You start at level 1 moga. You work your way up and up and up until <clears throat> you either run out rounds to win the battle in. Rounds will reset for each battle. Your health does not reset, however. Whatever health you, you, you lose 
during an earlier battle, you have to go on the trial with that health loss. <clears throat> so the two ways the endless trial will actually end will be to run out of rounds or <clears throat> if your team gets defeated. And then finally down here, you have the Moga Chip Dungeon, of which is one big Moga of which you fight with your entire team. You know, and you've got three difficulties, easy, medium and hard. <clears throat> Here you have the Gacha, of which within you can spend your GGM on <clears throat> and you get either Moga Chips or you can get full Moga. You can do one at a time, or you can do ten at a time. So a basic one is either 80 GGM for one, or 800 for ten. <clears throat> or you've got the dark card bag, which will get you premium MOGA. <clears throat> and that'll be 200 for one summon. Or... 2000 for 10 summon and at this point in time with the limited wind element card bag <clears throat> it will be the same as basic card bag <clears throat> and finally you have the in-game marketplace of which you can buy moga chips you can buy Equipment such as well items such as crystals and Astral nucleus and stuff like that <clears throat> However, no one seems to be selling any at the moment <clears throat> and You can Well at least you should be able to sell moga like full moga within the game as well as long as along with your equipment so again equipment being rings the scrolls and things like that <clears throat> i will show you uh, a battle but in the arena because if i show you a battle during the uh <clears throat> chapters and levels it'll go quickly because i'm so much higher level than the current MOGA I'm facing. So here we go. Here is <clears throat> a battle against a real person's team. Here you can see they've got Trollface, Wolf, uh, Crabbone, <clears throat> Ibex and a a moga that's escaping my and the name of a moga that's escaping my brain <clears throat> but there you go there's a battle i from that i won 1130 crystals i also gained gained arena points for winning that battle also <clears throat> if you don't like the look of your opponents you can hit that refresh button to get a new set of players i however like the look of my um opponents so i'm going to keep them and and um i'm going to battle one of them once i get round to it so that is everything I can show you right now. Oh no, no there isn't, no there isn't. Here is um, the event. So you've got Celebration of Genesis, which is just sign a daily sign in and you will earn word states. So tomorrow is 50 Alry chips and so on <clears throat> and then you've got monthly sign in 
as well. So day one, I got a thousand crystals. Day two, I'll get astral nucleus and whatnot. And, oh no, sorry. Today, I've got 10,000 crystals because it's the 31st of October. Happy Halloween, by the way. You've got, you've got Rainer's plea for help here. Which, you know the presents I was talking about earlier? Yeah, you can get things from Rainer through here by using the presents and bands. And the other two locked things, well, locked for me for now, is Horoscope Fountain which you can get a reward for an astral treasury, of which is also a roulette type thing, of which you can get a prize from. So that is everything. Oh, no, not quite. Again, sorry. There is just one more thing. You see here this green looking like symbol? You can exchange. You can exchange them for actual GGM. I don't have enough to do it, but as you can see, I have done a lot of exchanging here. I have exchanged 1,028. So, that's all good. And I have left, though. <clears throat> you know, so there it is. That's everything I can show you for now because I have not unlocked Homeland. As you can see, I am on chapter 2, level 25. So that is everything. That is everything I promise. That is everything for now. Like the video if you have liked it. Subscribe down below. Comment down below. Tell me how you are, how excited you are about this. And I will see you all next time.